Is Hamilton County incorrectly reporting student attendance to get more state funding? Good evening, I'm Calvin Snead. And I'm Latricia Thomas. That's what District Attorney Neil Pinkston claims in a recent report regarding the Udawa rape case investigation. News Channel Line's James Torres brought the issue up with the Department of Education. He joins us now with their response. James. Calvin Latricia, the Hamilton County Department of Education tells me a student is considered truant on the day of their sixth unexcused absence in a year. Now, according to state law, schools receive funding based upon how many students are enrolled, and it's the responsibility of the school system to report when a student is no longer attending school as soon as it happens. In the district attorney's report on Udawa, it's listed as a separate issue that came to light. A claim that accuses the Department of Education of intentionally delaying reports of truancy to receive more funding from the state. Hamilton County Juvenile Court Administrator Sam Mars. In here it's saying that the schools are reporting truancy very late in the year. Do we notice do we notice that in the courts at all? Do we notice mm -hmm. that? Uh, oh yes. Tennessee law states it is the duty of the school to report promptly the names of all students who have been absent five days without an excuse or who have withdrawn. That's something Pinkston says the schools are failing to do. Lee McData Student Services says that isn't true. Basically he was saying that we weren't turning in absences, but we are turning in absences. Uh, and they're done daily. In 2013, Juvenile Court Judge Robert Phil Yaw created a truancy task force and in 2014 released a report on recommendations to solve the issue of truancy in the county. Both the DA and the Juvenile Court say those are not being followed. It's disheartening because, you know, we're, we're about the children, they're about the children, and ultimately, um, if we can't improve this, it is the children that suffer. The administrators who deal directly with truancy under the school district say the DA did not involve them in their investigation for this report. Patricia. James, thank you. Interim Superintendent Dr. Kirk Kelly says the Department of Education will meet with General Pinkston this Thursday to talk about the issue. You can see the full report on the Udawa investigation on our website, newschannel9.com.